Well, hey, how are you doing? I hope you're I hope you're doing well. Um, it's Sunday afternoon. I'm headed back to church. I'm a little late. I'm going to be late anyway. I'm not late yet, but I'm going to be late for sure. Um, but I don't like to miss. I, don't, I like to be there. I like to be there um, for most services for sure. Um, so I'm headed back. And I wanted to get in this video because there's going to be like this barrage, this deluge of 2018 sucked. Isn't it great that 2019 is coming sort of videos? And I'll tell you what, I come at this a little differently. Um, were there things about 2018 that I wish were better? Well, of course. Did I get everything I wanted? No. Is that even possible? Y'all know I'm an only child, right? Is that, I mean, is it even possible that I could get everything I wanted? I don't know. Not in. I don't think not in this life. But what? I'll tell you what. It wasn't bad. I, I got. We got started on some things that we had wanted to get started on for a while. We started doing this YouTube channel back in February. Um, it, it, and it was something that we had we had talked about doing a, a my wife and I doing a program together we talked about for um, a, a number of years actually um, she would mentioned it and in February we decided to do Facebook live um, I thought it was the easiest thing to do um, because it's what I knew to do and then the thing you know it was the easiest thing to do right so and we have done it um, pretty much every Monday morning in February, uh, start, starting in February to the end of the year, um, we didn't do a show on Christmas Eve, I don't think, no, I think we've only missed one or two Mondays, uh, and we're going to do one tomorrow, but not at 9 o'clock, I think, the, the I, I know the program's going to be later, my wife works until 1, so um, it's going to be later, we're going to uh, ring in the new year with you possibly, so you want to look for that, that'll be cool. Um, but you know, I, I, I wanted to, while I had a few minutes while I was driving, I, I had a few minutes. I wanted to sort of tell you something that I that I've been thinking about as it concerns 2018 and as it concerns 2019, which will be here in just a few hours. Uh, so many people are so are always so excited about the new year, and because it's like hitting the reset button, it really is. It's like whatever whatever you screwed up last year or whatever things didn't happen, you can start again, and that's a that's an empowering feeling that you can start again, that you're not screwed forever, right? <laughs> you know, that's a good thing that, ah, oh, we're not screwed forever. We have another shot. Yeah, that's good. That, that, that is good. Um, but I'll tell you what. What I don't want you to do is get to the end of 2019 and feel the same way you did when you as you're getting to the end of 2018. I don't want you to feel like you're ready to throw the whole thing away and you just can't wait to start afresh. The idea is that, did you learn anything? Did you learn anything? Did you improve in anything? Are you better now than you were before? I used to work for a company um, and that at our national meeting, uh, we they took us to Arizona where the, where the I think the headquarters of the company um, well, um, was at the time, and uh, we had a session with Anthony Robbins' people. And I did learn a concept there. Now, a lot of those super hyper emotional, uh, motivational things for me are like, eh, okay. Uh, but my friend Ralph says, you know, eat the chicken, throw away the bone. And part of the meat I got out of that meeting, I, I've sort of taken with me over the, oh golly, probably 15 years. Um, is the theory of Kanai. C-A-N-I, Kanai. It's an acronym for Constant and Never-Ending Improvement. That's what it's about. So if you've taken 2018, are you better uh, than, than when you started? Are you improving? Are you be were you better in 2018 than you were in 2017? Uh, were you better in 17 and 16 and, and backing, 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 backing all the way? Are, are you better? Are you working on the things that you need to get better at? 
that's really, that's really what it's about. And so I am kind of excited because um, there were some goals that we had, things that we wanted to get started and start working on um, that we were, that we were able to, that we were able to, and we have been consistent in that. And I think that that's, that's exciting. That was an exciting part of 2018. And we were also um, looking forward to 2019 because we're looking to continue that improvement. After renewing our vows on on, on March 3rd, I guess, 2017, um, it sparked my my wife and I's relationship. That we renewed, excuse me, that we renewed our vows and um, it sort of reignited our relationship. Uh, It sort of, you know, went in a way that was, that's extremely powerful. It's different. It's different than when you know what when you're when you're nine, when you're twenty years old, right? You're twenty seven years old. You know what I'm saying? But it's different. But it reignited our relationship, and we sort of reignited our partnership. So we started doing the live cast on Facebook every Monday at nine o'clock, and we have been there. I think we've missed two two programs, uh, and we're going to be there not at nine o'clock tomorrow because Debbie works at nine o'clock tomorrow. Um, but we're going to be there, hopefully, to, to ring in the new year with you uh, tomorrow evening. So be sure to check that out for sure. But in any case, <clears throat> um, the things the, the things that we needed to improve, we have been improving on. And what I hope for you in, in 2019 is that you, too, improve on those things that you know need to be improved on. The, the most important thing to us is... Are you improving on your relationships, your relationships with your spouse and your children and your workmates and your family and those people that you are really are in relationship with? Are those relationships improving and are you doing something to make sure they improve? Uh, are you improving on your relationship with your savior? Savior, how's your faith relationship? How, how are those things going? Are you Are they getting better? Now, they may not be where you want them to be. All these things may not be at 100 yet. I'm going to tell you some reality. Out of, out of 58 years, I'm midway through 58 years, they may not, they, they may not ever be where exactly where you want them. But what you want is improvement. Is it getting better? That's what you want. So what I wish for you in 2019 is constant and never-ending improvement. That's what I wish for you. That's what we're going to do. And that's what we can help you through. Now, if you're interested in what we've, what we've been doing, please click on some of the videos that are around me right now. And um, take a trip back with, with, with Deb and I through 2018. Um, and enjoy. Again, we, we'll be on tomorrow, uh, hopefully to ring in the new year with you. So until you guys, we see you again, go out there and learn something, love somebody. And for goodness sakes, y'all take care of yourself. We'll see you when we see you. Bye-bye now.